just want to show this quickly. This used to be the Vision House, it was called. It was like a futuristic house of the future. I did a tour of it. Unfortunately, I don't think I filmed it. I did take lots of pictures. Now it's uh, something to do with Passholder Festival offerings. You can see inside, and they took all the stuff away to show how it was a futuristic house. But the outside is still here, which I'm excited. I want to show you all. I think a little bit more stuff outside, but it's gone. It's actually a pretty cool uh, thing to walk through. See a little bit with the fake green grass. Next time I'll be able to go in there. I'm pretty excited. Found the outside of it at least. At least that part's still there. Doing a lot of change of interventions. Okay, so let me go. No, it's extra only. So. But uh, again, this is where you would enter. Like I said, I went through it. It was pretty cool. Okay, well, that's all left of it, unfortunately. Maybe I'll see if I'll get my pictures up on here that I took. Now we're going in what used to be the Vision House. We've got our free uh, tumbler glass for an annual pass holder. Yeah, this used to be in it. it. Used to show like a kitchen, the bathroom, living room, uh, the backyard. Kind of like a little display.
Okay. Mine, um, I have a little keychain on top. No! I just reach for my keychain. I don't even reach for my hand. I'd like to have some information about the coming around the coin and the t-shirt. What's that on there? You see? The bottom? The smaller. The coin and the t-shirt. Yeah, we sell those t-shirts, the Passover t-shirts. And then we have, um, what's that? Yeah, we have a couple of other t-shirts. What do we need to get that? That we um, we need to see your pass and an ID. Um, I believe it's twenty four ninety nine. Really? Is that this? The coin. Yes. Yeah. 